Hello, joyful ones. Joan Craig here with Choose Joyful Health. And I'm welcoming you today to the Calmer This Year training, free meditation training that will be going on from January 8th through the 14th. Now next week the training will be at 6.50 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. The videos will be available all week for you to watch from any time zone, anytime. And in this video today, I'm going to give you an overview of what's going to happen in the training and let you practice using Facebook Live and also go ahead and tell you the very most important things that you need to know about meditation. So the Calmer This Year training is right for you if you've heard about meditation and maybe tried it but felt like your mind was too busy and you needed some help figuring out how to make it be quieter and more still. It might also be helpful for you if you've already been meditating but haven't been able to make as firm or as regular consistent commitment as you've wanted to. So whether you've been meditating for a while or it's been for many of us been an off and on commitment, I'm inviting you this year to really stick to it and reap some of those benefits such as reduced stress, better sleep, improved health, just feeling calmer, feeling more clear. And we can also use meditation to help us achieve our goals, both short-term and long-term in all other areas of life. So as I mentioned, I'm Joan Craig, and I founded a company called Choose Joyful Health. And one of the things that I do is help people do what they already know is good for them. <laughs> so that's one of the goals of this challenge. And I'm by no means a meditation guru or a master, but it has made a big difference in my life. So my goal with the challenge is just to share what I've learned, share my passion about it with you. And I've been blessed to have an amazing teacher named Roy Davis with a Center for Spiritual Awareness in Lakemont, Georgia. And many of the things I'm gonna share with you have come directly from him. So later in the week, I'll let you know how to find him and give you that link. So we'll go ahead and dive in. I wanna let you know the very most important thing that you need to know about meditation. And that is that if you were able to see deep, deep, deep within and peel away all the layers of personality and circumstances, what you would find is that at the innermost level, you are already pure, clear, well, and whole. You already have all the knowledge you need. And at your innermost level, you are pure existence or pure consciousness. So what we do in our meditation practice, it's actually their techniques that we do, tools that we use to help us clear away the distractions from experiencing and knowing our true nature. Hi, Melanie. I'm just going over the very most important thing that you need to know about meditation. And that's that you already are the pure conscious being that you think you're trying to be in meditation. You already are it. And you're already there. So we're not really going anywhere as much as we're stopping being still and letting go of all the distractions that keep us from experiencing and knowing our true selves. So today I wanted to practice a little mini meditation to get us warmed up for next week and it's simply a mindfulness meditation. So I hope that you're in a place that you can either stand up or sit down, but hopefully not driving. <laughs> and where you can be relatively still. So whether you're sitting or standing is not as important as your spine. You can even be lying down, but 
it's ideal to have the spine upright. So if you're a yogi, you already know what that means. But basically balance the crown of the head over the pelvis. Breastbone up, shoulders relaxed. And tune into your breathing. You're welcome to close your eyes. And the simplest breath awareness is just to feel the breath coming in through the nostrils. And feel it going out. And be aware of the coolness on the way in. And the warmth on the way out. And just stay in tune with that breath. Tune in to now start to broaden your awareness from only the breath to your whole body. Be aware of how your legs are, feet, arms, hands. Maintaining your spine erect, just relax and release any extra tension. And from there, we can shift from micro-awareness, micro-awareness is awareness of all the details, to macro-awareness. And in macro-awareness, you just start to be aware of yourself as the watcher, or yourself as the observer or the witness. So on the micro scale, you're aware of your body, how it feels, how your breath feels. And on the macro scale, just be aware of yourself as the witness or the observer. And this is really what we're looking for. First to become conscious of what is, and then to become, as my teacher says, super conscious rising above the normal level of brain activity and brain busyness, we rise above that to a state that's superior to that where we have a lot of clearness, clarity, calmness. So next week what we'll do is each day I'll teach you just a little mini technique that you can use to get into that super conscious state. And I just want to of course, acknowledge that there's many, many, many systems of meditation and I don't have all the answers. This is not the best way. It's the tools that I use and I hope that they'll be useful for you to put in your meditation toolbox. So I think that's it. We'll get started next week. I'll be here at 6.50. I'll actually be here a little bit before that so that you can find me. If you don't see the video when you first log in, just refresh your screen a few times. Looking forward to the Calmer This Year Challenge. Thank you for joining. And peace. Let me know if you have any questions in the meantime.